Hey, welcome back to episode 37 of Factorio Chasing Achievements. It seemed kind of weird to go straight into a time lapse, so I thought after that I would record this intro so you know what's going on. So, uh, in about four minutes, look forward to hearing me say pretty much the same thing all over again. Alright, welcome back to episode 37 of Fat Terror Chasing Achievements, where uh, I fixed the base. <laughs> uh, yeah, we have all the science going now, uh, but last time we did fail by 12 minutes to launch a rocket in 8 hours. 
which is entirely my own fault. Uh, looking back at it, uh, there's a lot of things I could have done. I could have made the process of production more important, more quicker, made more of it more early. Yeah, not much I can do now, so I'll have to just live with it. I'm not going back to do it again. Uh, but now we have a base that I have fixed and we need to go and do all the rest of the achievements which are all the way down along the list um, which basically entails building a big base and to build a big base we don't want to do it by hand so there's a few things we're going to want one is robots and two is completely gone from my head one is robots two is something else I had it seconds ago. Right, well, whatever. Robots is one. <laughs> Laser turrets. Laser turrets is the other. So we can not have to worry about making ammo and carting ammo around the place for guns. Uh, this bottom line took quite a beating while I was fixing things, so I had to add in some more turrets all along it. Uh, with some other problems as well. Perhaps you've seen them because I added them on at the beginning. Perhaps not. Either way. Um, but what is probably our first primary issue is... We do not have enough copper. Which actually, now I look at it, it's, it's a supply issue. It's not a supply issue because this is a full belt. None of them are stopping, they are running. But it does seem we need more circuits, which makes sense because a full yellow belt can only supply uh, nine. I think it might not even be able to supply nine of these machines properly. And we have 12. Because before this, we had more copper. But, um, okay, so I've set up some extra mining here. That's a little bit more we can get out here on the end, which I think we will. Right. Down. Get in like this, and there we go. Papal. Yeah, the other problem, uh, of course, with this was actually steel production was far too small. This needed to be at least double this, if not more. Probably if we built a full double-sided belt thing um, and then put some buffer chests in. Because there were times that we just needed more and more, especially at the end. We actually got held up by steel production into low-density structures. Which is not good. Um, at the minute, we're having trouble with these guys, but that's because these guys are stealing up, I think. Um, but yeah, once he's back up, because they're not being used very much now, we should be good. They were being used like one a second. They're still being used one a second. No, I'm not sure. Well, he's got to back up this whole belt, so that's probably why. Uh, and everything should stabilize. Anyway, we should get a research going before we do anything else. The most useful thing. Um, I need the power to be nice. Uh, well, laser guns, we want laser turrets, so we need the laser research. Let's do that quickly. While we're waiting, we can set up another uh, copper smelting column just here. So, what is it? It's uh, not this for starters. So, you jump under. We go into a splitter. I haven't played for a few days. And it shows. Um, you jump splitter as far as you can. And then you jump two. If we were going to have another thing, which we probably aren't. So. Like I said, uh, while we were playing in the beginning, uh, this base is likely going to become a. <laughs> A starter base. And then we'll use this base to build another base which has more capacity. But part of that is going to be making sure that base is defended. Uh, speaking of which though, we need uh, 24 I think. 24 furnaces which we can build 8 of and then we're out of brick. Brick's easy. Brick is hidden away up here somewhere. There we go. Oops. At least now we're out of steel. Uh, we should get laser turrets. 
but it's not a big deal what we research at the moment. Uh, what probably will be interesting is probably I want another attack. Goes to map view, doesn't zoom there, it's annoying. These trees are actually helping quite a bit, just holding them up. Oh, that doesn't look so good. Oh well. Not using a huge amount of military science at the moment anyway. Yeah, it was nice to see that the uh, late hour challenge now is not, I mean, I was expecting it to be easy, but it's not, uh, it's not as simple as it was before. Pretty sure if it had just been uh, the old sciences, red, green and blue, and then alien, uh, we could have easily have uh, achieved it. I think by like the eighth episode we had blue science and that was after building all this gubbins. So I think on uh, previous versions we would have had that in the bag, no problem. Do you have some old power balls, so let's use them up. Which they give out the spacing nicely. Whether we one short? Yeah. Oh there we go. Problem solved. Ah, of course this guy was a one of those for a reason. See, it allows you to have two. Still gonna need uh, mid 13 out of 15, so we need nine more, which is steel. Yeah. Alright. I can just run over everything and just, well, some things I already have in my inventory. Right. Wait for the chest to fill up a little bit more. In the meantime, we'll pick up. Just do what we have at the moment. Probably should put those down first though. Okay, uh, belt. Down to there. I guess what we'll do is uh, this point. Let's feed that in, because that should be able to solve the whole lot, and if it doesn't, we'll just run it along again and feed it in further down, so more of this can get through. Uh, steel. Just steal some steel. Uh, 11, I need uh, 9, was it? Is it still 9? No, it's not 9, it's 6. Good thing I didn't make the uh, the rest. Not well, exactly the end the end of the world. We had some extras. Uh, I still haven't done the damages yet because we haven't have them to do damage with. Uh, robot speed's kind of pointless. Uh, That's probably the best thing. We are going to want this. Logistics system. More importantly, it's the whole thing. Oh. I thought that was still separated. That wouldn't make sense, would it? But yeah, we'll, we'll research that. It'll be a good use of things. So it's going to take a hell of a load of resources. So I'm not going to have to make that decision for a while. These ones are still struggling to get enough ore through. I mean, it's not like there's any gaps in this. It's confusing why they're struggling. I guess just because it's all being used, maybe? 
And this is slightly more than these belts can accommodate. That must be the reason, I suppose. Uh, but this is getting to the end, so that's good. This will back up. Which will mean things can go to other places. Speaking of which, one thing we can do now... Build lights. Take a lot of power, but... At least people will be able to see things. Iron stick, iron and gear, uh, circuits. Hmm. You fit it in, yeah. In, in. Maybe along. I will just dump them into a box. You're going to make me lights, you're going to make me steel rods. You all gonna need power. There we go. That works. I can sit and pull away with some lights. I will make some in my inventory anyway. Put some down. Okay, that circuit's covered. Next thing we're gonna want is uh, we need a lot more steel, but we're gonna handle that in a minute. I think. Yeah, no pollution. We're going to need a lot more iron. So I think possibly a load of landfill. Then bring this iron over purely to smelt into steel. And then bring the steel in. I think that could be a good idea. Then we'll look at walling off some of these areas. Make a safer space to build in. Uh, and we do want solar panels. So why not? Make me like two stacks. Oh. You can't. <laughs> oh well. Um, don't do that then, I guess. This isn't really the amount we need. It's just going to be another drain on steel anyway, so it's probably best not to. Uh, accumulates are kind of pointless. Okay, so let's build some robots then. Uh, we don't need a huge number of robots, but it would be nice if we could get quite a few quite quickly. Don't think that's going to be a possibility though. Batteries is easy enough, steel. Ugh. Engines is. We could steal them from here. Hmm. It's really worthwhile. Got circuits here. No longer in a rush, so immediately taking far more time than I need to. Alright, pick up all the ones on the floor. Put the rest in there. Alright. These take a long time. So let's do a combined. Oh, it's done. Right, cool, that's a bit quick. Uh, what else is immediately useful? Nothing really. I guess modular armor is probably the best place to go next. Or should we get some more of these mining productivity so we don't have to go building up new mining outposts quite so soon? Uh, we'll go for that, and we'll go for I don't know, five of these. Build them in the right place, or just four. Why not? In fact, build them like this. Bring this across. You're all going to make robot frames. Where are they? Right there. You need uh, steel and electric engines. Where do we get those from? So we actually have electric engines here. You could siphon off actually very easily. Yeah, siphoned off. 
It's just a case of getting steel here. Where do we have steel? That's steel. Hmm. We could root this really badly. Underground. <laughs> uh, under here. Right, so now we have steel, which we will get down a bit up over oh not there 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 we go on a side where it should be convenient and right past that or inconvenient as it might be okay production science we have to jump like that hmm out of those, okay. Easily fixed. I probably want to grab one anyway. Easy way to jump all this. There we go. That should work. It's a car out of the way. Oh, no, don't no okay well whatever bye car see you later hmm. so we're gonna want a number of Build it here. No, 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 this is in the way of our bus, so let's go the other way. Can't pick that up. There we go. Empty my inventory very quickly. What we'll do is we'll have a machine on each side of here. Too far apart, but oh well. That's, yeah, no, we, do, we can do it both on this side. Doesn't matter if one gets priority over the other, so we're going to limit how many there can be anyway. Okay, so these guys need circuits. Where am I getting attacked? Out of ammo again. Or already, as it actually happens to be, uh, you are going to make construction robots. You're going to make not construction robots. And we have to find a way to get this stuff down, which should be easy. Uh, in fact, we just do a. Oh, you need. Uh, okay, well, we'll have to. Adjust for that. It's not a problem. And you have no power, of course. There we go. Uh, have all the engines I've got. Mine drills I'll keep. Oh, yeah, I want to bring these with me, I suppose. Across we go. And we'll feed both of these into a robo port we don't have. Uh, we can't make it on our steel, of course. Why would we have enough of anything? So, this has got to be the next thing we do is just build a crap ton of steel processing. It's got copper on me. I picked up that huge belt full of copper. Surprisingly. 
That results in you having a large amount of copper on you. Who would have thought? It looks like iron supplies are dwindling again. Not good. Never not for the minute anyway. So this guy's going on there. We should be able to build. Yeah, probably build four now. Then we will also need oh, copper cable, which I throw everything away for. So let's go grab some copper because we might as well just build it ourselves. Just need a couple of copper cables. Come on. Gonna keep that steel, but get rid of those. Yep. Making more materials. And the possibility that could be better served in the steel furnaces. No, it's not a supply issue there, it's a uh, lack of resources issue. Alright. You have no power. Solve that. Then you need uh Okay. Uh read robot status X and no Y and Z. Y is less than Let's have hundred is probably too many, but go for it and then you would be set to T of course so we'll only end up with a hundred of each which is fine for now at least anyway Ooh, what we can do though let's also put construction bots into a box that should be a passive provider. Just one, not no stacks, one stack. And those will get delivered to us once we have the things that need it. Alright, so this line is basically defending itself. We have a bit of ammo, so let's go back up to power and make sure. Robots. Back up to the power power plant and make sure it's ammoed up. Good repair packs. Okay. Well, of course it's going to be repair packs. We keep damaging things. I guess <laughs> we'll go with fifty. Solve that, not you. Damn it. Well, that'll solve that problem. There we go. Solves my uh, inventory problems as well. Let's make while we walk back uh, a few of these. We'll dump them in the uh, rubber ball and let the robots just do whatever they're going to do. Okay, copper's looking good, iron's not looking so good, and we need steel. There they are. Have um, these. I'll have the rest. Well, I'll have that many. 
no doubt I'll need them. Uh, okay, so next thing is going to be... Ooh. Hello. That's getting a bit more serious. These guys have... I think these guys have bigger range than our turrets. You've run out. So I guess we'll be heading over there. So next thing we want to do is set up uh, some landfill production, which should be easy. Yeah, these guys were running out of ammo. Put in. And the box has nothing in it. Those stuff was picked up. Alright, well. I guess you can have half of that. You're not too bad. You are just filled up. You're, you're not great. So what I'll do. Spread this as best as I can. And those guys, what just got destroyed? Oh no. Okay, well this could be a problem. We haven't even started thinking about setting up uh, laser turret production. What do they take? Steel, electronics and batteries. Again, steel, another thing we don't have any of. I should just run along this belt and nick a load of ammo. It's pointless just going up there. If we don't have any ammo, and we definitely need to go up there. Oh, there's the car. We can use this tiny patch to make steel. I'm sure that'll work. Pretty sure it won't work. Uh, how do I get through here? Eww. This looks good. There we go, clear. Right, two. Uh, what is basically our primary iron source at the moment. Still looking decent on actual iron. That's good. Uh, you can have 50, you can have 50, you can have 50, you can have 50. Uh, we do have ammo, so let's uh, get that in. Oh. Damn it. It's got no ammo. Let's get rid of this base. That may have been a mistake. <laughs> right, let's try again. Come. Run the hell away again. Any of these guys have an ex oh, they're all bad to run out. This one just ran out first. Urgh. Okay, I'm gonna have to take 25 out of each of these. We'll have 50. Oh. Okay, well. <laughs> It's not going well. Alright, then we've got enough two turrets. We have one turret up here. This is a mistake. Possibly actually worse than it was before. They've all got. You've got 34, so. Sorry. But we're gonna have to share that. This is not gonna last very long. Hopefully, moving that away will 
cause attacks to get triggered less often. That's pretty much all we've got time for in this episode. Uh, it's probably actually run a little long, but I've put that bit at the beginning. Well, thanks for watching. Next time we'll uh, yeah, we'll try and get laser turret running as quickly as possible, which means steel. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.